Hi guys, welcome back. I'm Paige from Snap... <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back. I'm Paige from Hazel Tools and I'm your YouTube Snap-on Guys daughter. I'm thinking my uh, YouTube account has been hacked. <laughs> you guys let me know in the comments if somebody's been messing around with my YouTube account. We're over at Addie's birthday party and... And soon we're gonna head to the shop and get some stuff done. So stay tuned. I guess the uh, <laughs> the only reason that we're here is because this whiny kid right there, that one, that's my oldest. And he's mad because he never makes it in any of the videos. So today we're going to be decorating the truck with some 4th of July decorations for Monday. And let's walk back here. And my dad also got some footage from one of his shops of a bunch of Snap-on toolboxes that we'll be showing you later. And then way back here, there's this orange toolbox that we need to clean up and take the stuff off of it. and load it up on the truck so that we can find it a new home. All right guys, we've been working hard. Uh, it's probably 10, 30, 11 o'clock at night, inventorying this uh, repo stuff, going through piece by piece of what we have here. We'll just kind of give you a little closer view. I got stuff piled up because as I went through it, that way we don't count it twice and don't miss it. Um, cleaning up some of the other stuff as we're going through it, so it's starting to look a lot better. I know you guys were like, oh my god, how do you get your tools so dirty? Well, he uses them, that's how. So we use the tool wipes and uh, cleans off pretty good. Here's part number on that, WOD5020. Works awesome, not only clean up the tools, but to clean up the toolbox. So going through that stuff, I got more over here. Remember this thing, the drawer was falling out. I got the slide changed over, so now the drawers are nice and even. And it's just a matter of gotta go through it piece by piece, clean it up, get it ready, inventory it. Bunch more of the stuff that we have in here. Here we got our aluminum spool gun up here uh looks like a plug-in for a varus and then this is my workstation i'm set up on the welder there working everything jotting down all different part numbers so that's what we're up to tonight so this will be an ongoing process here i would say for probably the next uh three four nights just to get through all this stuff you know like the ball joint kit we could uh, sure use to clean that up a little bit, make it look nice for the next owner. Um, it gets a little bit more money for the product, which gets a little more money towards the guy's account to help pay it off. This orange toolbox that we only had on here for about a day and a half. So we're gonna get this unloaded right now. And then later tonight, we'll come by and pick up the guy's trade. So awesome. A lot of you guys might've seen these shots. I put them on uh, Snapchat and on Instagram. And it's actually a Thursday stop for the Cornwall guy and the Mac guy. And I actually, I like to stop in there. Sometimes we uh, warranty each other's tools for customers that we can't service. And we get together and, uh, you know, talk about the business and talk about where people have moved to and stuff like that. Here we go unloading that trade-in that we took in on that camouflage toolbox. And Tracky looks over. There's Jamie's feet. Okay, guys, so what we are got going on here is a little uh, PM. We got the... Uh, generator down here and I need to get the oil changed on this thing. It's starting to warm up. We're running the air conditioning a little bit more so we're going to work on that. Me and Jamie got the truck pretty much loaded up for uh, tomorrow morning so we're good there. So let's get to work and get this done. So here's our setup. Uh, we got the Diet Mountain Dew for the diabetic guy. Tripod. We're going to set that up. We got our snap-on ratchet and socket. Oil filter. And this is uh, the TOY 640. That we sell on the truck works perfect for these little oil filters so underneath we need to take the oil filter off and then we have the valve to drain the oil and then we'll fill it up easy peasy
Now that we got this all finished up, we're just going to button it up and uh, we'll give her a run for a little bit, make sure everything's good, no leaks. So there's been a lot of stuff going on lately. Um, Jamie's been really pushing me, keeping me busy, and that's great. We've been getting out seeing a lot more customers each day. So that's a positive. I'll give you a little look around the truck here. We did some decorating. Make sure you go to uh, our Snapchat. Look me up there. I'll put the address down below and uh, as well as the Instagram. I try to post on there every day so you can kind of see what's going on. So let's take a look around the truck. So one of the projects I had Jamie working on is we got a little birthday list going on. So if I come over here and I'm gonna just click on my calendar, she has been inputting everybody's birthdays so that we can keep track of them. Writing them down on the paper and then getting them into the uh, Outlook calendar. So let's walk through here. We got it decorated up for the 4th of July. You seen Paige um, with the decorations. So we got that on there. Uh, another trade-in toolbox. We just picked that up today. Put that on here. Move some snacks to the back. Now that I have this used box back here, I can't put anything against the back door because then you can't open the drawers on there. So we put all these snacks on here for the guys so they can see them. Got our flags up. Got flags behind flags. Looks real good. So Jamie's working out perfect. Um, I think I might have sneaked a picture of her on our Facebook page. Might be able to find it there. She's still camera shy. I asked her. She says not yet. Another project that we have been working on is with Snap on Credit. And when the guys update their information, that we have in the system sign up for a line of credit you know it does a credit check on them but it opens up a line of credit so they can buy larger ticket items maybe a toolbox a scanner or maybe that big set of wrenches they've been wanting for quite a while and what we're doing is we're giving away these mugs to our customers it's a three-in-one mug it's kind of a neat little deal and then in addition to that i got a smoker grill you can't hardly see the picture i'll try to get a little bit better picture i got this smoker grill sitting in the back of the warehouse and i'm giving my customers that sign up for that tickets towards this smoker grill we're going to try to give that away the week before the fourth of july so the weekend before the fourth of july i'm going to do the drawing so that maybe somebody can have a great smoke and cookout for the fourth of july all right my friends i appreciate you watching i appreciate the comments i try to answer as many as i can as well as the likes and all the subscriptions coming in that is fantastic we'll keep this train rolling make sure you check out my snapchat and my instagram i'll add you on there and on that note you guys have a great night hi guys i'm Paige from hazel tools and i'm oh shoot hi guys welcome back i'm Paige from hazel tools and i'm your snap on you <sighs> Hi guys, welcome back. I'm Paige from Hazel Tools and I'm your snap. YouTube. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back. I'm Paige from Snap. Hmm.